Understanding of what you hear. Is the male and nurse listen to the text? Summach tell Jawab a Sahid and choose the correct answer. Be what the died at in how the last Murasi by putting a circle around the appropriate letter. So you listen this text in Google Classroom and then you will choose the right answer here. The Kalam speak at the dribble of will. The bad the lila silata wala juvata mazamilik. Exchange the questions and answer with your colleague. Halik taradat loga tuka bad the lalfazila alfazim nila pia uskur bad and minha. Did your language take some words from Arabic? Mention some of them. Anyone? Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Assalamu alaikum. Okay, the word Assalamu Alaikum Naam. is taken from Arabic. Okay, then yes, Mushkil. Mushkil, okay. Mushkil. Okay. Mushkil. Kitab. Okay, words like this. Halik uh, Did your language take words from other languages? Mention some of these words. Anyone? Yes, Persian. From Persian. Uh, he wants Urdu has taken words from words. Words. Uh, P and Chim. For me, Arabic. Pak. <laughs> Pak. Like shua shua I use in Arabic, but it is not in the Arabic word as far as I know. Then many English word nowadays they take from uh, the Arabic has taken many English words, especially the television. 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 Yes. At the Zibu what will you do? Is anturi dina ta allum al lugatil arabiya. What will you do if you want to study Arabic language? Join Arabic class. Anyone else? Does anyone agree with this? Yes. Okay, join Arabic class. So, what is the Arabic for this? Join Arabic class. Yes. No. Sal Tahiko, correct. Fi Fasilin Lil Logatil Arabia. I will enroll in the class for Arabic language. Okay. Or I will enroll in Arabic Institute. Sal Tahiko Fil Mahadil Arabia. Mahadil Logatil Arabia. Or one thing that you can do is memorize the vocabulary. Jamia. Around 5,000 words are needed to learn Arabic. Okay. Oh, vocabulary. Yeah. Yes. Maza tafalina is anturi dina dirasat al Islam. Very important question. What will you do if you want to study Islam properly? Turidu. Islamic Islam. Mm, Amina, what will you do if you want to study Islam? I will go to Islamic school. You will go to Islamic school. Result. Okay, then. then. What will you do after that? Uh, read Hadith. Answer. After that, read Quran with translation. Okay, Mr. Lama, what about you? What will you do if you want to study Islam? I mean, I will go to Saudi Arabia. 
What if you don't get visa? Then what will you do? Go and light me today. If you don't get the visa for Saudi, what will you do? Huh? If you don't get the visa for Saudi, or let's suppose you can't go to Saudi, what will you do? Yes, yes. What will you do? I'll go to Madrasa. Madrasa. I'll go to Madrasa. Okay. Our local Madrasa. Satya, most importantly, your answer. What will you do? Miss Sasa. Assalamu alaikum, sir. Wa alaikum, salam. What will you do if you want to study Islam? So any answer? Most of the things I can do. Sorry? I can't understand you. Most of the things I ask in you. Okay, you will ask me. Okay. Now listen, everyone. The answer of Rizwana was close, but uh, not correct. She said, okay. and the uh, answer of the uh, Amina and Rahma, I will not agree with that answer. Okay. Because if you okay. just go to school, they in the school, they just uh, teach the basic things. Okay. They don't okay. tell the things in detail. If you want to study Islam, you yeah. need to learn Islam in detail. Answer of Rizwana was close, but she said that she will first learn Arabic. And learning Arabic usually take at least two years. This is a long period. So <clears throat> we need to start three things together. We need to start three things together. First thing, Arabic, of course. Then along with it, hadith. Quran. And along it with Hadith. So if you don't know no. the Arabic, then you can read the translation as well for the time being. Let's suppose you are a newbie. You don't know anything about Arabic. So make your schedule in such a way that 20 minutes for Arabic, 20 minutes for Quran, if you don't know Arabic, then of course you will read the translation. And 20 minutes for Hadith. Of course, if you don't know the Arabic, then you will read the translation. I, I told all these three, sir. Arabic, Hadith, and Quran. But you said, first I will learn Arabic, then I will start. Arabic, learning Arabic is a long journey. We can't because you want to uh, read Quran in Arabic, sir. Hmm. But it will then you can read the translation. But it will take some time. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now you can read, now read about Rasulullah's life also. It also gives so much him. Yes, that is included in hadith. In hadith, the hadith. life of Prophet Sallallahu is ex explained in detail. Yes. In fact, hadith is a collection of whole Islam. It tells you about every single thing about Islam in detail. For example, our teacher once told us that if you go to faculty of Tafsir, you will study only Tafsir. If you go to faculty of uh, Sira, you will only study Sira. If you go to faculty of Tajweed, you will only study Tajweed. And other, it took the name of other faculties as well. But uh, if you go to faculty of Dawa, you will learn Dawa only. But if you go to faculty of Hadith, you will learn all these things in one faculty together. So, okay. What will you do if you want specialization specialization in Islamic studies? Anyone? So which number is that? Number three. Uh, no maza is written there. Only two ridu. Here it is written. Maza taf alina izan turidina 
تریدی نت تخصص آفین دراست الاسلامی اوکی anyone we leave our country okay so you will basically we will enroll in the university because it's not degree thing can you tell me the name of your universities where you can go Al-Azhar Jamia Al-Azhar okay then then and the university in Islamabad okay so Al-Azhar University then Islamic University Islamabad then Jordan sir I don't know the name of institute but most of the people go there Okay, you can go to Jordan, but Jordan is very expensive, I think. <laughs> but most of the, uh, I read about them, uh, this, uh, the, the, the eyes and others. Uh, for example, Dr. Rumor, Suleiman and all, they all went to Jordan and Syria maybe, also. Maybe they go on scholarship. Syria. Yeah, otherwise yeah. on, without scholarship. Syria, they easy. go. So these are the men first people used to go to Iraq, no? Sorry. Before people in the past used to go to Iraq. Iraq, yes. Iraq was also, but it finished, I think, quite finished. a long time ago. Yeah, very long time. So at the moment, the Azhar University, then Makkah University, then Islamabad University. Madina. These are the three universities. In Medina, they only I think. Uh, allow those who are on scholarship. So that is a difficult admission. Yeah, first they uh, study in Azhar and then they go to Madina. I heard that. That we can go directly there as well, but for that we need Hifaz. Maza Turi Dina that is a Tahasusa Filduva Telarbiya. What will you do? You want specialization in Arabic language? Join a university. Yes, Al Tahiko Fil Jamia. Okay. Al Arabia to Lugatun Alami Arabic and international language. Fi Ayi Asrin Khan Atil Arabia to Lugatun Almiya. In which era? The Arabic was universal language. Just like today we see English is the universal language. There was a time when Arabic was the universal language. At that time, the Euro was in dark era and the Arab world was the jewel of the world. So Arabic was the international language at that time. Halik Yes. Did the European languages took words from Arabic language? Ma ahada full istimar is kafi. What are the targets? What are the goals of cultural istimar? Mean there is a word in English colo. Colonialism, something like this, difficult word. Let me check. Colonialism is the more. Yes, you can also call it colonialism and imperialism. So, what are the targets? What are the goals of cultural imperialism or cultural colonialism? Halil Albiya Alil Arabiya to Lugatun Alamiya to Nilana. Is the Arabic language a universal language at the moment? Kana til Lugatul Arabiya to Lugatan Alamiya tan fil Asril Abbasi. Arabic language. Kana to was Lugatan Alamiya international language. Fi en al Asril Abbasi Abbasi era. Allazi in which is the harat it flourished. Allazi in which is the harat flourished. Fihi in it. Al Hadarat al Hadaratul Islamia Islamic civilization. 
كانت اللغة العربية لغة عالمية في الأسل الأباسي الذي الذي ازدهرت فيه الهزارة الإسلامية Arabic language was a universal language in the Abbasi era in which it flourished, in which the Islamic civilization flourished. I think I did not, okay. Who this? Hafsa, read this, these questions. Aye, as a ring, Kanat, Kanat, till Arabia, till Lugatan, Alamayatan means in which era? In which era? In which era? Arabic will be a universal language? Yes, Arabic was a universal language. Did the European language uh, take words from Arabic language? Yes. What are the goals of cultural cultural what? Cultural imperialism. Then, Al-Arbiyatu Lugatun Alamiyatulana. Is the Arabic language a universal language right now? Yes. So the third question, what are the goals of cultural imperialism? Basically, whenever uh, such an imperial state or colonial uh, country attack another country, they change their culture, they try to change their religion, and stuff like this. For example, if you see the map that you see at the moment, you see this Soviet Union conquered all this territory. And what they did, first thing they did, they banned Islam. They put restriction on Islam in all this area. So as a result, if you now go to this country, you will see People have Muslim names, but most of the people know nothing about Islam. And even like basic thing, like alcohol, they consider it a normal thing. They even don't know that alcohol is not allowed in Islam. So that was a very good example of al istemar sukafi in which Soviet Union did all this. But fortunately, when they reached there, they also captured Afghanistan. At that time, it, the holy war started because at that time we knew that from one side, Soviet Union will attack Pakistan and from other side, India will attack Pakistan. So Pakistan started holy war against Soviet Union at that time. And for I as far as I know, for 15 months, not a single Islamic country and not a single other country helped Pakistan in this war. Look, there are so many Islamic countries, but for 15 months, it is a quite a long period. Not a single country helped Pakistan. After that, USA joined, and when USA joined then these countries also started supporting Pakistan in this war. And then of so course, major role was uh, Hamid Gul, no? Yes, General Hamid Gul. He yeah, was I read about him. ISI chief. ISI. He did everything. Hmm. 
but tajikistan and all yes. then, then became same country and when started pakistan this at that time our relation with the usa were not good but soon we realized that uh, uh, fighting this war alone is a difficult thing and also we need to make atomic bombs so to avoid international restriction we made an alliance with usa also that the main purpose of that alliance was only so that we can fulfill our atomic program easily without any international restriction so alhamdulillah that was started and it remained for i think maybe around 10 years i think after 10 years soviet union was defeated and then all these countries that you see here the all these countries into including afghanistan also this area was freed and this area was also freed from soviet union it was a quite a long battle sir which year that was uh, the year was i think st- uh, the official invasion from soviet union started from 19 i think 79 maybe i think 1979 oh. yes and i think in 1981 uh, in 1980 Paks- uh, the pakistan started the holy war and in 1981 i think it was the the first attack of uh, russian air force on pakistani soil they did on the western part of the pakistan at that time oh. and in 1983 i think 1983 india launched attack on this siachen area yeah i think it was in 1983 i'm not sure about this date but they started so at that time it was clear that from one side russia will attack and from the other side india will attack that time thing got hit it allah akbar allah is great and and the president of russia said to pakistan that we will make a horrible example out of you for the rest of the world <laughs> They themselves become a horrible example. He only uh, broken into pieces. Yes. <laughs> no USSR now exists. Yes. So I read on the okay. Pakistan at the Arabia to Lugata till Kalhidara Adarati, and the Arabic was the language of that civilization. Adara means civilization. التي ترجمت اليها الكتب من اليونانيه والفارس والفارسيه ترجمت translated اليها to it الكتب the books from yunanian mean uh, what we say greek, greek language والفارسيه and persian so if you remember before the period of arab these were two superpowers in the world uh, one was roman empire his language was yunania and other was persian empire so they were the all the knowledge at that time was taken from these two so books from greek and persian languages were translated to it to it mean arabic language books from the greek and persian language were translated to that language and the arabic was the language of that civilization so the books from greek and persian were translated to it wa allafa biha al ulama wa bi fi tibb wa al handasati wa al riyadiyat wa al ulum wa ghayr zalika wa allafa and wrote biha with it al ulama the scholars fi tibbi in medicine wal handasati in the in and the engineering wal riyadiyat and mathematics 
wal ulum and the science wa ghairi zalika and other than that and the scholars wrote with it in the medicine and engineering and mathematics and science and other than that wa hammalat al lughat al arabiya tilka al ulum ila uruba and the arabic language carried those knowledges to europe faqanat so it was asasa the basic of al hadarat al gharib gharbiyat al hadisa basic of modern western civilization so it was the basics of modern western civilization who is next i think amina كانت اللغة العربية لغة العالمية في العصر العباسي the Arabic language was international language in in Abbasi in Abbasi era in Abbasi era all the all the Zahrat be Hadarat al Islamiyati and it flourished in Islamic civilization in which the Islamic civilization flourished in which the Islamic civilization flourished وكانت العربية لغة تلك الحضارتي عند العربي وثلاثة سفلسيش and Arabic was وكانت لغة العربية وكانت العربية لغة and Arabic was the language of that civilization التي ترجمت إليها إلي كتبه من ال من ال من ال يونانية والفرن والفارسية والفارسية وألف بها and it was translated into no the books of the Greek and and Persian were translated to it. To it. For Alpha Bihal Ulamao, for Alpha Bihal Ulama, no, Ulamao, the diff. And the hundred of them? Allah wrote Biha with it. Oh, with it. PDB in medicine, 130, and uh, and engineering, were Riyadiyat, and mathematics, Wal Ulumu, Fira Dalika, and science, and, and like, something like And other than that, basically, et cetera, I mean, et cetera. Oh, et cetera, Fira Dalika, et cetera. Okay. حملت اللغة العربية تلك علوم إلى أوروبا فكانت أساس الحضارة العربية 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 الحديثة العربية الحديثة الحديثة and it carried Arabic language carried those those in Europe, in to Europe, to Europe, and it became. It was the basic of modern Western civilization. Modern civilization. Marat bil Arabi. 
بعد ذالک اصور من الدافی بعد ذالک افٹر ڈیٹ مرت بالعربی پاسٹ ان دا عربس اصور ان اعراض من الدافی آف ویکنس ابتدعو فیہا ان دینہم دے ونٹ اوے ان اٹ فرام دیر ریجن وَحَجَرُ اللُّغَةَ الْعَرَبِيَةَ الْفَسِيحَةَ and Fusair Arabic language migrated basically it went away Fusair Arabic language went away وَاسْتَعْمَلُ اللَّحْجَاتِ and they used dialects so they left the Fusair Arabic and they started using dialects سُمَّا جَعَ الْإِسْتِمَارِ Then came the imperialism. Fahara bas sakafat al-Islamiyya wal lugat al-Fasiha. So it fought the Islamic culture and Arabic and first Arabic language. Then the imperialism came and it and that imperialism fought with Islamic culture and Fusar Arabic language. وَشَجْعَ اللَّحْجَاتُ And the dialects were promoted. فَقَانَتْ هُنَاكَ لَحْجَةٌ مِسْرِيَةٌ So there was an Egyptian dialect. وَأُخْرَ مَغْرَبِيَةٌ And another Moroccan dialect. وَسَالِسَةٌ سُورِيَةٌ And a third one Syrian dialects, Wahakaza, and like this. So Arab passed after that. Arab passed with the through the eras of weakness. They got away from their religion. Basically, they left their religion, and the Fusa Arabic language also left, and they started using dialects. Then the imperialism came. And that imperialism fought with Islamic culture and Fusa Arabic language. And the dialects were promoted. So there was an Egyptian dialect and another Moroccan, Moroccan dialect and another third one Syrian dialects. And in this way, there were dialects. Okay. وَقَدْ and perhaps ada it led هَذَا إِلَىٰ تَفَرُّكِ الْعَرَبِ and perhaps it led to the disintegration of the Arab وَبُودِ بَادِهِمْ أَنْبَاتِ and they got away some of them got away from other basically in their distances increase which mean their unity this was destroyed. Bihai so in such a way is a safar al Arabi min baladi la baladin Arabi in Akhar. In such a way, if an Arab traveled from one country to another Arabic country, Wajata baz so bati filitisali bi ahali zali karbalad. He found some difficulties in speaking with the people of that country. And when they used to speak with their dialects, and when they used to speak in dialects, it, the communication does not, the complete uh, communication did not achieve, was not achieved between him and them. And when they used to speak with their dialects, the complete communication was not achieved between him and them. Illa except except when the conversation was in Fusa Arabic language. So when it was in Fusa Arabic language, they used to understand each other completely. Otherwise, they don't use to understand each other completely. اختلف الامر اليوم The matter has changed today فدا 
so the dialects have weakened. وَقَوِّيَتِ اللُّغَةُ الْعَرْبِيَةُ الْفَصِيحَةُ And the Fusa Arabic language became strong. بِسَبَبِ التَّعْلِيمِ وَوَسَائِلِ الْإِتِّسَالِ الْحَدِيثَةُ Because of the education and modern means of communication. وَأَصْبَحَتِ الْعَرْبِيَةُ لُغَةً عَلَمِيَةً مَرَةً سَانِيَةً كَالْإِنجِلِيزِيَةَ وَالْفِرَنْسِيَةَ وَالْإِسْبَانِيَةَ And once again, Arabic language has become a universal language like English and French. And Spanish. Fahiya ehda lugat il rasmiya fi hayat il umam il mutahida. So it is one of the official languages in the United Nations organization. Fahiya lugat us saadi satu fil alam, and it is the sixth language in the world. Itahad subiya aksaru min miyataini million Arabi, and speak with it more than two hundred million Arab people. وَيُوَدِّ الْإِبَادَاتِ بِهَا أَكْسَرُ مِنْ مِلْيَارِ مُسْلِمْ And they give, they perform the worship with it more than one billion Muslim. And more than one billion Muslim perform their worships with it. Next time we'll study this lesson again, inshallah. If anyone has any question, they can ask me. Ma'asalama. Ma'alaikum salam. Ma'asalama.